Ooh, there is a mag with some more Lysias. And we just killed Alistair, and now you go and kill the housemaid, Jovita. Just that weird one folding clothes. Mr. Wagner, this is Wayne Preston from the Herald. I wonder if I could ask you some questions about the recent deaths at Dante Manor. This is a private line. How did you get this number? Five deaths within a few months. It's quite a sensational story, Mr. Wagner. The public needs to know. Winter Hill Police Department. This is Senator Charles Wagner. Please put me through to Detective McGuffin. McGuffin. The press are closing in on this, Mr. McGuffin. I have an election coming up, and I can't let this get out of control. I sympathize with you, Mr. Wagner. These journalist types are like vultures around every sad case I get. They just love tragedies. But what can we do? It's a free country. I need to keep this out of the papers, Mr. McGuffin. We've had a run of bad luck. It's as simple as that. The stakes are high, and I'm under a lot of pressure to clear this up. The pressure is on both of us. Your mess is making the precinct look like a joke, and my superiors are not going to take it lightly. Yeah, well, you won't know the half of it unless you get this wrapped up. Is that a threat, Mr. Wagner? That's not something you want to find out. A couple of phone calls can do wonders. Okay, oh, angry. I wonder if we kill him at some point. Detective McGuffin! A word with you, please. How did you get in here? You're working the case here at the Wagner Estate. I'd like to ask a few questions about the series of unusual deaths that have occurred over the last few months. Now listen to me. You leave those people alone. They've had some bad luck is all. They're nice people and they need space to get over their losses, okay? And if I find you anywhere near this house again, I'll run you in. You got it? That's him told. <laughs> I was almost ready to bring in the Latina maid. I was planning on searching a room, hoping to find a bottle of rat poison or a padlock. But suddenly, it was too late. Seems that Tom Wagner, brother of Charles, had an affair with two of the maids. I guess one of them found out and wasn't happy about it. Can't really figure out what they saw in that guy. I mean, he was mooching from his brother and doing God knows what in his dirty little film room. When we searched that room, it was a sick pervert's nest. I mean, they had a kid in that house. Little did I know about this kid. McGuffin. Check our Ouija board. In the back of an eye, memories are born. Further still in play. You can sit there, Mr. Ball. No. There, Mr. Bolt. Oh. Oh. Right. Alright, I'm gonna kill that anyway. That's, that's fine. No. Have you seen your Tio? Your, your Uncle Tom? If you see him, can you let him know that I need to talk to him? No. Seen. Your uncle yet? Jeez. <laughs> That's our real. Well done.
Knall. What does that take? Can't break it. Hmm. Don't know. Where's she going? Skip, go, I know there's something going on with your Uncle Tom, but maybe I need to go see Uncle Tom. So he's been carving on that set. This is nothing here. So when a is having a nice bath, he is Save my cup, so I need to find it. Do I actually have it? Sorry. Can you give me my tire iron from the storage room? Storage room. This is the storage room, man. Have you seen that cassette around yet? Is this it? Hey, little dude, ever seen one of these? 
Can you get me my tire iron from the storage room? It's not my head. Oh, it's fierce. I'll put the fuse then. Um, to do. Probably I've already got the fuse then. Yay! But I don't know where that thing is that he's asking for. Run oh, By the way, a there's a tape of my band lying around here somewhere. Turned the light on, mate. That was pointless. Now I'm gonna go up there. I'm sure you kill one of the maids off the balcony. That's why I wanted to for sure it off. Yeah, upstairs. Oh, I don't think this is. That's. See, that's. They're high enough. These ones aren't. So I need to go up. Even further. Still don't know the combination to see here. Hey, son. I know I promised to spend time with you. That's mean. And that's not all. Have you seen these drawings he made? This is really starting to concern me. Hey, you're trying uh, to bet me, aren't you? I'm just having a chat with your mother. It's just a little grown up talk. You're so dead. Morning, son. You need to be careful not to bother your Uncle Tom. He says that you really have been bothering him. You know how he likes his privacy. Grown-ups are talking now. We'll continue. Oh, right, that room. Right, I know what this is. Hello there, boy. Everything seems to be going well. I wouldn't be surprised if he's like part devil. Okay. Where's Mario? So then I know how to get up. Oh. No. Right now I'm just going in circles. Uncle guy. 
No. She has a Is oh, she's at night. Oh, yeah, how you doing? Okay. She your uncle yet? Uh, no, nope, but I'm taking control of you and I'm gonna throw you off the top. It's too far. Oh, what's close enough for her to do something? Mr. Ball, Mr. Ball, you. Let's go. See your uncle yet? Stop asking me, because you just saw me to saying you. Where does my uncle Mark? That's Madam and Dad from downstairs. One plus one. Right, I'll go. I if I my uncle and get on his shoe. I don't know, I trust the house to be called Dante's man. Well, Dante's man. Probably the way you want to see it. Give me another hand. No, just the same hand. The 
is it when I'm down in that balcony I kill it? Maybe. Have you seen your tea? Chap. So you the oh. Ah, uh, yeah. Good. Uh, I'm not dead end now. Hey there, boy. <laughs> Don't you know. Thanks. Good. I know what's going on here. I know. I've seen the signs. Hello there, boy. Yeah, he well. definitely evil. Uh, we've gone too far. Why do I know? Am I looking the right way? Yeah. I feel like I'm not. Because it's not showing. I am so confused as per usual. Nice painting. Ah, this is a place where it's tedious. Oh. This might be the place that we're meant to go. I need to turn this first of all. I'll turn it. Nope. I should go give this to the girl. So this is that girl's room. Wait, see if I open the door and not. So Uncle Thomas, I if I could see something. Let's make sure this thing's really tight on. It's so funny when you see it though. Camera. There's a camera here. So you said that my telekinesis has the whole way down. Ah, that was well. Um. Them in here. What's the Jesus saying? Can't 
can't be that. Camera though. Alright, so I'm not even in the right place. What ones? Alright, the creepy guy. Right, I know. I think he's on the other side of the building, aren't he? Then here is it this way? Up the stair and Are you alright, son? No, I just have two people shagging. <laughs> A bit over the top, but this is almost head. I'm not good with directions. Ah, there it is. I will go dip. Oh, ah. he's not looking. Go, 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 go. go. Oh jeez, yes, yes. Everything yeah. seems to be going well. That's so creepy. Is that the way out? Yeah. Time to take some pictures of people going at it. I need to go all the way back up and get found. I'm going the wrong way again. Where's the film? Oh yeah, no, I know where that is. Put that in that. Hello there. I don't know if that policeman hasn't seen them yet. He's meant to be making sure everyone is not going crazy. <laughs> How can she not? Oh, yeah, right. Just gonna stop there. Wait. Where am I going? Oh, this one. Open the door. Seen your uncle yet? Yeah, I uh, have, but then he's been bad, and you should maybe see these. Hello, Lucius. Have you seen your Tio? Your, your Uncle Tom? If you see him, can you let him know that I need to talk to him? Hello, Lucius. He turned around. Seen your uncle yet? 
Yes. Look. Hello, Lucy. Have you seen your Tio? Your, your Uncle Tom? If you see him, can you let him know that I need to talk to him? Seen your uncle yet? So, did I not take the right picture just now? Alright, round two. Wait. Yeah, it's me taking photos. <laughs> Smile for the camera. Hey. So I do have the right picture. This is so cute. And I'm showing you the picture. But you don't care. Hello, Lucius. Have you seen your Tio? You, your Uncle Tom? If you see him. Right, I'm at 20. I need to talk to him. Can I not hold it? Hello, Lucy. Have you seen your Tio? Your, your Uncle Tom? If you see him, can you let him know that I need to talk to him? See him. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Something I'll need to place it, Owen. Seen your uncle yet? Is on the table. Oh, maybe put it in our room. I should hide the photo into your room and plant some evidence to blame her for some of the other deaths. Ah, so I'll leave some, leave the padlock and stuff. So this. Let me put it there. All right. Did I hurt? No. Half range. No. Yeah. Matches. No, you're not living here. You're not living here. No. <laughs> there we go. The half range. 
Seen your uncle yet? No. Oh, she's in the Oh my god! How can he do this to me? I don't know. Why? Oh, why? <laughs> Where she ran to? She ran to her thumb. <laughs> she had her thumb. That's what Me and Victor went crying to the balcony. She knew it is a really good day. Oh, she does it to my advantage. She is not running to the balcony, she's running to her thumb. Oh, why? And then we throw her off. Why would you run to the balcony? Why would you not go and find him? Oh, why? Assassin's Creed. <laughs> that was like an, an Assassin's Creed fail. <laughs> yeah. I'm playing Assassin's Creed 2 right now. So it. it seems we found an obvious culprit in Miss Javita Munez. The missing padlock from the cooler. The rat, the rat poison? poison? It almost seems too convenient. Why are you telling me this? It's not like we were close or anything. Well, we have a motive too. You're shagging her. Pictures of you and Susan Myers, and how should we put it delicately, flagrante delicto. It seems your involvements with the staff are a little too tangled. What? I knew nothing about this. You mean she did all this because I had a fling with Susan? Oh my God! What have I done? Tom hasn't done anything. His indiscretions may have led to this, but he would never have put them up to it. There's no reason for it. <sighs> Look, this whole thing is a freaking mess and I'm trying to put a cap on it. So both of you listen good. Javita was stealing from the house. She poisoned Agnes because she was onto her. We'll ignore all the, uh, indiscretions in the report for the sake of your family whatever it takes detective we want to put this all behind us i'll straighten tom out but i don't think i'll be able to save my campaign at this point the press will have a field day well there's nothing i can do about that mr wagner but they won't get a story from me i'm just trying to make a living we'd finally managed to close the case sir so i thought Seems like she had been behind every death so far in the house, yeah. except the butler. It kept bothering me. Could that really be an accident? Every path we took on the case left me uneasy. Then, right on time, a month later, it happened again. It looked like another suicide. It might have been me who pushed him over the edge. And for that, I am ashamed. Uh, don't blame yourself. It's me the whole time, you know. Hmm. <laughs> hey guys, I'm gonna leave this episode here. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe if you want to see more, and I'll see you in the next episode. Thanks.